breaking right now at 6. A contractor has been selected to build a new terminal at Armstrong International. The consortium that lost the first round of the saga then lodged a protest, which led to the entire selection process starting over. Won the contract this time around. It is a $546 million expansion at Armstrong International. Reporter Travis Mackle here now in studio with the very latest on this breaking news. Travis. Camille, that's right. The combined bid put up by Hunt Gibbs Bow Metro has been awarded this contract, which, as you mentioned, is valued at more than $500 million. Hunt is a national firm, while Gibbs Bow and Metro are all locally owned. Metro is minority owned. The committee making the selection chose this group over NOLA Airport Builders, which included companies like Parsons and Oderbrack. That group with locally owned company Woodward Construction won an earlier bid, but that contract was tossed out after we first reported that a member of the selection committee previously worked for Parsons. The search committee gave the Hunt Gibbs Bow Metro Group a score 50, point high, 50 points higher. Then NOLA Airport Builders. We do have a crew at the airport getting reaction. We'll let you know what they have to say coming up at 10 o'clock. Scott. All right, Travers, thanks. Now an update.